Someone stole not one, not even two, but close to 20 Christmas trees from a Virginia Beach lot. And despite that dent that it puts in the pocketbook of the small family business, the owners tell Ten on Your Side Stephanie Harris they are still in good spirits. Absolutely. They are happy for good health, for family, and for friends, despite what was taken from them. They will, however, be making some changes, and they want to pass along the advice to other tree sellers in hopes it won't happen to them, too. You can't miss the tin soldiers standing along Shore Drive or the sounds of Christmas inside the shop they guard. Owners Maggie and Bill Schratweiser love the season and their clients so much, they decided last year to make their Christmas wish come true. People kept coming in saying, when are you going to sell them? When are you going to sell them? They started a tree lot. We had a lot of people come back and say it was the, the freshest tree they've ever had. Don't you think? You can tell they're great trees, though. They smell. They didn't make a ton of money, but that really wasn't the point. No, that one looks kind of funny. Too tall and skinny. It's about community. For me, the joy of seeing the families run around the lot and the kids picking out their tree. Over the weekend, they noticed the lot seemed sparse. Bill counted and came up 19 trees short. That's about $1,200 worth. That's terrible. Now, Maggie won't be able to provide hot cocoa to customers as she'd planned, but we'll continue a tradition of giving away a tree and a holiday dinner to a family in need. Nobody was hurt. Um, we're out some trees, and there's not much we can do about it, but keep our spirit up. They'll also put up more lights and some cameras, a sad necessity that now comes with bringing Christmas cheer. I think this is our prize. What do you think? I think it's perfect. Perfect? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Right. Sold. And they'll do it all again next year. You know, it could be worse. Maggie says because of the Christmas tree shortage this year, they were only able to get 149 trees. That's 100 less than they had hoped to get. So this theft really hits even harder. And they know that the chance of finding the thief or thieves is really slim to none. But if you can help, call police. Stephanie Harris, 10 on your side.